Hi friends, it's Miss Anita again and today we are going to be working on day four of our morning message. If you will look at the board and if parents, if you would like to write the morning message down for your kiddos, that would be great because at the end, once we read it and clap it, they will be going and trying to find a circle, the focus letters, okay? So let's start with our focus letters for our day four morning message. Okay, so the focus letters for today is capital Y and lowercase y. Say it with me, okay? Capital Y and lowercase y. Good job, friends. Now, I'm going to read the morning message to you, okay? So, here it is. Yancey pilots pretty planes okay get your clapping hands ready so we can clap our morning message okay Yancey pilots pretty planes okay friends now that we have clapped our morning message now you're going to go and find and circle our focus letters so the first focus letter that we're going to start with today is what letter is this? Capital Y. So you're going to look in your morning message up here, and you're going to find a circle, capital Y. I'll give you a second. All right, friends, good job. Now that you have found capital Y, now you're going to find lowercase y. Here's lowercase y right here. So look at the morning message and find and circle lowercase y. All right, good job, friends. Okay, that concludes our circle time for today, okay? Okay, so now... We're going to go to our reading time. And today, we are going to talk about airplanes. What can you tell me about this vehicle? You can talk to mommy and daddy, and you can let them know. What do you think, what can you tell them about the vehicle? All right, good job, friends. Okay, I'm going to ask you another question. Have you ever been in an airplane before? I have. It's so much fun. Now, I want you to talk to your parents about the experiences you've had on an airplane before. I know when I was on an airplane, my very first time, it's like when it takes off, it does something to my ears. My ears were like stopping up and, you know, and then I felt that adrenaline and that rush and I was like, whoa, but it was fun. And then I looked out the windows and I saw all the beautiful clouds and how far we were off the ground. Did you have that kind of experience too? Now, can you all tell me, are your parents, talk to your parents about the different parts of an airplane, okay? So I'm displaying this card, okay? And if you have any toy airplanes available, you can also use those to talk about the different parts of the plane, okay? I want you all to point out the wings, the tail, the nose, and the engines on the airplane, okay? Now, this is a different type of airplane. This is called a jet, okay? And it had just taken off, which moved off the ground and into the air. 
and you want to know how I know it had just taken off because the wheels are still down. They haven't gone up into the plane yet. And when the and when the plane flies, the wheels will be pulled up into the body of the airplane. And then before the plane lands, it touches back down onto the ground. And the pilot will lower the wheels again. So when it takes off in the air, the wheels will go up into the body of the airplane. And then once it lands, the wheels will go down because... The wheels, we need the wheels to land on the surface, right? Yeah, exactly what I thought. Yes. Okay. All right, friends. So now that we've talked about the airplane, here are a couple of vocabulary words that you can focus on as you talk about airplanes with your mommy and daddy. Fly. Land. Nose. The nose part is this part. That's the nose of the airplane. The pilot, which is also called an aviator. The tail of the plane, which is the like the end of the plane. Okay. And when it takes off. And the wings of the plane, which are right here. All right, now we're going to sing a song, and it's called Fly an Airplane, and it goes like this. Come with me and fly, and fly an airplane, and airplane, and airplane. Come with me and fly, fly an airplane way up in the sky. Fly this way and that way and that way and this way. Come with me and fly an airplane way up in the sky. All right, friends, that concludes our reading time. Okay, moving on, we are going to talk about our letter Q. So, we did it three ways this week. We built it with, what are these pieces called? They're called what? Wood pieces, okay? So, we built it using some wood pieces, okay? And then we wrote it on a whiteboard with a marker, okay? And then we wrote it on a what? Chalkboard, that's right. Good job, friends. And now we're going to write it on paper with a marker. So if you have a sheet of paper, find a sheet of paper, get you a crayon marker, and let's practice writing our letter Q again. All right. So now, friends, why don't you tell me and tell your parents, where do we start our letters? That's right. We started at the top. Okay. So now you're going to put your crayon or marker at the top. And you're going to make a, a magic curve, and you're going to keep going, and you're going to stop at the top, and then you're going to add the little line. See? Does your letter Q look like my letter Q? All right. Good job, friends. Well, thank you for tuning in, and see you again. Bye-bye.